Hello, everybody. Hope you're having a nice Sunday. Here we are with Candy's puppies. We got some puppy nonsense happening. Candy's over there eating dinner. <laughs> um, and I've been trying to get these puppies to eat some puppy kibble, puppy food. Um, Dr. Karen was here today to do an exam on everyone. And especially Rolo. Here's Rolo. <laughs> um, no, that's Rolo. I'm sorry. This is Heath. Heath. Rolo. Um, because Rolo has not gained weight in four days. Let me see. Let me weigh him right now. Um, but Dr. Karen did a house call today and said that he looks good. Um, and, uh, you know, the thing is, is, let me weigh him real quick. The thing is, is Candy's, Candy's milk is drying up and that's the issue. Let's weigh you, buddy. Hang on. Hang on. Whoops. Oh, I turned the camera around by mistake. Okay, here we go. Let's weigh you, buddy. This is Rolo. Let's weigh you. Um, and um, he is eating normally. And, uh, okay, he's up five grams. Okay, that's better than yesterday. He's been stuck at 560 grams for four days in a row. But he is eating. I think the issue is... Candy's just running out of milk, so we got to get, she's running out of milk, you can see it. We got to get these babies to get used to this, so I've been taking little, put it in your tongues, put it in the mouth, licky licky, come on, you got to get used to it, guys. Yeah, you got to get used to it, your mama's running out of milk. Yeah. Here, but here, this is Heath. Hi, Heath. Hello. Can you show, can you, can you try to have a little look? Yeah, look at that. Ooh, yum, yum. This is, oh, we got a peepee. -pee. Good boy, Rolo. Good boy, he just made a peepee. -pee. Here, here, try to have, let me push this over here so I can change the wee wee pads. Oh, 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 he's walking into peepees. Okay. Okay, you just want to, there, pull that out. Okay, here, let's try and, can I interest you guys in, in any of this? What do you think, Rolo? What if I hold it for you? Can you taste it? Look, yum, yum. Ooh, there we go, yes, yes. Look, ooh, look at that. Here, right here, honey. Yes, he's licking it. Just got to do a lot more of this to get them um, used to the puppy um, canned food. So this is um, puppy canned food. There's a little bone broth and a little water. <laughs> a little water is in there to make it uh, softer. Um, Twizzle, are you still napping? Let's see here. Um, come on, you can do it. Come on, Rolo. Come on, honey. Can you, can you have a little? Oh, look, look, Crunch is eating it. <laughs> He's slipping. What is this? Are you doing a yoga pose? What is this? What is this kind of way to eat? <laughs> hey, Heath, why don't you be the leader and show everybody? Come on, show everybody how to eat it. There we go. Yes. Yeah, let's come. Let's show Rolo how to eat the food. Here, buddy, here. Whoop. Candy. Oh, 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 oh. Candy, come here. No, 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 no. Come here. No, 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 no. How did this get open? Uh, the gate must have not been open. I must not have closed it. <laughs> Poor Cece. She just she just came in here looking. And Candy was like, no. Come on, Candy, come on. Okay, thank you for not hurting anybody, Candy. It was just a lot of noise. Oh, it scared me. 
CC was just curious. She didn't want to hurt your babies. Okay, what do we have going on here? What do we have going on here? What do we have going on? Candy, what's happening? Um, here. Oh, gosh. We got to get more Riwi pads. I'm going through these. Like pink candy. Ah! No, no. No, the door is closed. Cece came in here. She was just curious. Cece has no intention of hurting anybody. She was just curious. <laughs> Poor Cece. She went running. She went running. And Mabel, you want no part of that. Come on, Candy. The door's closed. Come on, Candy. That was scary. I didn't know if Candy was going to hurt them, but she didn't. I'm so proud of you. You didn't hurt Cece. You just used your voice to say, back off. Good girl. Thank you for not hurting anybody. Okay. You're just protecting your babies like a good, good girl. Okay, so here, let's see. Can we try and get... Can we try and get these babies to eat some food? What do you think? How about you, Twizzle? Here. Okay. Rolo's going to try and nurse. Um, okay. If Rolo's going to nurse, can we let everybody else... Um, can we give Rolo his space? Can we give him his space? Because there's not enough milk for all four of you. What if we do, okay, hi honey, can we try and get some, can we try and get some little, look, put it on your tongue, taste it, mmm, yum yum, ooh, can you taste it, <gasps> yeah, what does that taste like, is it yummy, is it yummy, mmm, can we try and eat some? Look. What do you think? Oh, Rolo's trying to eat. He's trying to nurse. Candy, you're doing such a good job and it's not your fault, but I think you're running out of milk. Um, which is, oops, oops. Hang on, Heath. Can we just, can we just let Rolo have a chance at that? Rolo needs to gain the weight more than you. You're doing pretty good. Here, try a little bit of this. <laughs> try a little bit of this. Come on. There we go. Ooh, yeah, you can do it. I know it doesn't taste the same as the milk. <laughs> Come on, babies, here. We got to try. We got to try to start supplementing you. Because your mama's running out of her milk. She running out. Heath, you was a big, great boy. You was the best. You were the best boy ever. And your little tongue is out. Oh, my God. I cannot handle how cute you are. Um, Here, let's give it another try. Come on. Can we try a little bit? Here. What if I hold it up for you? Here. Ooh, yes, 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 come on. A few licks. Yes, yes, yes. Let's get crunching on that crunch. Can you have some too? <laughs> um, so we don't know their exact date of birth, but our best guess, our best guess based on when the first puppy opened his eyes um, is that they were born on September 26th. That would make them 31 days old today, if that guess is right. I think we're, we're guessing within probably a three-day range. Uh, so, here, honey. Oh, pfft, what happened? Heath just fall over. Okay, Rolo's nursing. I know, Candy, you don't have very much milk left to give. But, okay, here comes Heath. Heath is looking to get in on some milk. <laughs> Heath, let's let's wait till Rolo's at least done. After he's done, you can try and get some milk. Okay, let's try and get some of this stuff. Look, mm -hmm. yum yum yum. Here, 
How about you, Crunch? Can we get you to taste a little? There. How's that? <laughs> they both want to come over and get some milk. Yeah. Here. I just want, I want Rolo. Oh, see, here's what's happening. Candy walks away. Candy, come here. I think she's just really. Come here, Candy. Okay, there goes Crunch. He wants some milk. Candy, come here. Candy, ah, ah, come here. Come here, sweetie. No, no, no. The door's closed. You don't have to worry. Come here, sweet girl. Candy. Okay. Here, let's try. Hi, here's Heath. Heath, you want to try and have a little? Oops. Did you just fall down go boom? Good girl. Here comes Candy. What a sweetheart. Oh, Heath, you are such a sweet little man. You're so sweet. You got your little food on your chin. That's, I'm so proud of you. You tried to eat. I'm so proud. Yes, you was a big grown-up. I'm so proud of you. I know. Poor Mama Candy. Um, Dr. Karen did an exam today when she, when she came over here. And, um... Candy doesn't have a lot of milk left, and uh, Dr. Karen, what was that? Yeah, <laughs> you were walking a little like a little drunk puppy. Um, Dr. Karen said to just keep massaging the milk through because, um, oh boy, here they go. Candy, yeah, I think that's, I think this is why Rolo's not gaining weight because Candy's probably walking away and. The other puppies are persistent, but Rolo gives up. So, like, when, when Candy walks away, Rolo gives up, and he doesn't try to go back and get more milk. So, okay, honey. Okay, this is little Rolo. But you did gain one gram, five grams. I'm so proud of you. Five grams, first time in four days that you gained weight. Five grams counts for something. Okay, so let's see. Can we try and get you... How about some of this? Do you want to try some of this? Can you get it on your tongue? What if I put a little... A little bit on your tongue? <laughs> a little bit? A little? little? Oh, here you go. Yes. Does that taste good? Do you want some more? Here, a little bit more. Yeah, here. Here's a little more. Look, you got food on your face. Here, honey. Oh, oh, someone just walked in the food. Crunch just walked in the food. Okay. Here, sweetie, can we try a little? Can I hold it for you? You want to try a little? Oh, yes. No, no, he's trying to lick. There, there, that's what we want. He's licking it. Good boy, good boy. That's what we want. We want you to be able to lick the food. Because you need it. Yes. Good boy. Oh, yeah, I just got to keep trying to get them to take the canned food. Because, Candy, you're running, you're running low. You're, what are you, <laughs> what's she looking, what is she looking at? Is she looking at the reflection up there of the lights? What are you looking at, honey? You're such a good mama. You're such a good mom. I'm so proud of you. Oh, look, someone just put himself in here for a nappies. Heath. So this is Heath. This is Crunch. That's Rolo. And that's Twizzle. Twizzle has been napping. Candy, what are you looking at? What are you looking at, honey? You're so beautiful. Come here, baby. Come here, beautiful girl. Come here. Come here, honey. You're so perfect. Her fur's growing out. It's so soft and silky. I think you might be a Maltese mixed with something. Because as your fur's growing out, it's so soft. It feels luxurious. Soft, soft fur. Oh, look, Rolo's trying to get some milk. Good, good, good. We need this. Okay, Candy, good girl. You're a good girl. I'm so proud of you. 
Oh, we have a wish list if anyone wants to send gifts to the puppies. Our wish list is at iheartcockerspaniel.com. And, of course, we need donations. Candy needs donations for her eye surgery that's going to happen after she's done nursing. And her space surgery and her dental. She's going to get the dental on the teethies. Yes. Look at your teethies. You're going to get a dental. Yeah. You're going to feel so much better when that eye comes out. Yeah. She is on glaucoma meds, and it's a blind eye already. There's no reversing it. And that little raised bump right there that you see is where there was an old puncture wound and that scar tissue that grew out from the puncture wound. And she can't, she actually can't close the eyelid all the way because the scar tissue is raised. You can see that, the scar tissue bump. It's like the size of a pea bulging out of her eye. Yeah, you can see it. So as soon as she decides that she's done nursing, we can um, we can get her moving forward with her next steps in her medical stuff. I'm so proud of you. She is such a lovely, lovely girl. So lovely. Okay, Rolo's trying to eat. That's very good. Very good. Right, Candy? And uh, Crunch fell asleep. Hey, buddy, should we just move you to uh, some more softer? There. Hi, Crunch. Nestle's Crunch. Candy, um, it's just a coincidence that you were turned into the shelter with that name. And it's Halloween. And your puppies are named after candies. It's just a coincidence. Twizzle. Okay. Let me, let me get this little dude. He's still napping. Whoops. You napping? I'll just put you back in here. He's napping. Hi. Hello, sir. He's just napping. Oh, hi. Oh, are you waking up? You want to just say hi real quick? Say hi. I'm Twizzle. There you go. Okay, Rolo's trying to get some milk. Candy. We want Rolo to get as much milk as he can because he needs it. Yes. Okay, well, not much is happening. I guess everyone's napping. There's Twizzle. There's Crutch. There's Heath. There's Rolo. And Miss Beautiful Mama Candy. So... I hope everyone's having a great day. If anyone is um, interested in adoption of either candy or a puppy, go to campcocker.com and read about our adoption process. We are based out of the Los Angeles region. And yes, we do adopt out of state. However, um, we do not waive any steps of the adoption process. Uh, please don't ask us to send you a dog or ship you a dog. Just like anybody else who adopts from us who lives in California, out-of-state adopters are treated exactly the same. They complete the screening process and then they uh, come to Los Angeles to adopt in person. That helps us to get the most enthusiastic adopters ever. We get the best of the best of the best adopters. Did you know that, Candy? What's little Rolo up to? This has been the best mama dog. She is so brave. She's so brave. And she's such a good mama. Have you ever lived indoors before? Because the way you looked when you arrived at the shelter was clear you were an outdoor dog for a very long time. Have you ever lived indoors? Do you like it? I think she likes living indoors. I think she likes... The safety and the routine and a clean environment and climate control. Oh, this is her favorite thing right here. This is her move. She likes this. The chin rub and the little chest rub. Look at her. She could practically fall asleep right now. She likes this. This is her favorite right here. Chin, 
You just yes. Is this your is this your favorite? Whoever adopts you, should we put this in the adoption agreement that they must it is required to give candy daily um chin scratches and chest scratches. Should we put that in your adoption agreement? Should that be part of the um the conditions of whoever adopts you? <laughs> they have to um they have to do a daily chin scratch and little neck and chest scratch because it relaxes her. She loves it. Oh, honey. So beautiful and perfect. You're perfect. Oh, good. Rolo's still eating some milk. Whatever's left in there. Okay, Candy, you're doing good. Oh, look, she's going to try and walk away from them. Honey, is he still attached? No, I know. I understand. I understand. She's doing a lot more of this. She's, um, she's looking for places to go uh, have some privacy away from them. And then here's little Rolo. Rolo, can we try one more time to get you to eat a little food? One more. Oh, my God. His little tongue is out, too. Look at you. Hi. Can we try just one more? Here. Let's see. Look at all the toys here. Let's try this. Look at that. Ooh. Can I interest you in this? Ooh. Oh, yeah. He's drinking the water, the watery part he likes. Yeah, that's a little bone broth, water, and puppy canned food. I made like a little, little mushy. No, no, <laughs> no, you walked away here. Let's try. Come on, let's try. Can you lick it? Here, sweetie. <laughs> He's walking. He's like, no. He's like, lady, why are you putting that in my mouth? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Candy. I know, Candy's hoping that they'll start eating puppy food soon, too. She's like, come on. Come on, boys. She's like, give your mama a break. Let's see, is he going to lick some on his own? No, he's not. No. Oh, I think he's making a pee-pee. Are you making a pee-pee? Yep. I could tell by the way he was standing. Hi, honey. Do you want to try and have a little bit more? No. Nope. He said, no, thank you. He said, no, thank you. I would not. No, thank you. Okay. There's Rolo. Oh, my God. What are you? Are you like a Maltese, Shih Tzu, Lhasa, Poodley, Terrier... What what is you? Um, their coloring is starting to look like Shih Tzu, right? His coloring is looking. Here, let me change how I'm holding you. So look, doesn't he look a little bit like a Shih Tzu mix? Can't wait for the DNA test to come back. Boop, 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 mm, boop, 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 boop. Mm, boop, 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 boop. <laughs> you got a little food on your nose. Oh, my gosh. You are so sweet. Okay. All right, honey. Do you, do you want to go nappies with your brothers? Yeah, should I put you in there? Is it nappy time? Everyone's napping. And this beautiful mama... Candy, you're so beautiful. She's so little. Such a tiny little girl. Um, she weighs around nine and a half pounds, but that was, um, let me see, when did I weigh her? A few days ago, but that's with milk. So I don't know what she's going to weigh once her milk dries up. But definitely, she's not going to be more than a 10-pound dog. She's going to be perfect for somebody so perfect okay well i think we're done candy did you eat a bunch of your meal <laughs> let's see <laughs> 
So she's got multiple different foods to choose from. <laughs> and I'm putting them now. This is her little... She gets to eat whatever she wants. So, <laughs> Candy, what did you eat tonight? Okay, she loves... Her first favorite is the cottage cheese. Her second favorite is fresh pet. There's two things of fresh pet. Um, her third favorite is... Um, just food for dogs. That's the chicken and rice recipe. Her fourth favorite is this was, um, oh, this is made for mama dogs and puppies. And it comes frozen fresh. It's frozen. And I forget the name of it. Um, it was, uh, we got a few boxes donated by one of our supporters, Nahid. Um, and then her most least favorite is the canned, canned pup, that's canned food and she sometimes doesn't even eat the canned food. I offer it just in case. Um, she's a little messy eater. But, um, oh, and then, oh, and here she's got puppy kibble. She usually doesn't eat the puppy kibble except overnight, like, because I give her fresh food right before I go to bed. And fresh kibble. And then usually by the time I wake up in the morning, all the fresh food's gone and half the kibble's gone. So I know that... At some point during the night when you run out of fresh food, you start eating the puppy kibble. Is that right, beautiful girl? You are so beautiful. I'm so proud of you. Okay. All right. Well, I think that's I think that's about it. I will wrap this up. Let me see if anyone had any questions. I didn't even Let me check the comments. If anyone has any questions, pop them in right now. Um Let's see here. Um, but anyone who's interested in adoption, go to campcocker.com. Um, Candy will be ready first. And um, probably, I mean, it would be great if we could find her an adopter um, who is ready, you know, soon. Because then what we would do is we would get her her, her dental, her spay, and her eye nucleation surgery. And if she um, has adopters waiting, she could go and recover in her new home. And um, anyway, so, uh, oh, and, you know, we have actually tried puppy formula. And, oh, someone's suggesting goat's milk. Um, they, the puppies are like, no. They're like, you're trying to do a bait and switch. That's not our mama's milk. Who do you think you are? So yeah, we've tried other source, other types of milks to offer to the puppies, and they're like, nope, nope, we like what we like, <laughs> and uh, <laughs> the puppies is smart. They is very smart, and I think they got it from their mama. Candy, you're very smart. Candy, did your puppies inherit your smartness, your beauty, and your your smart? Your genius smarts. Oh my God, she's so beautiful. Okay, spread the word. Let's start getting some adoption applications in on Candy. Because I, it would be great to have adopters waiting for her when she's done nursing and done with her surgeries. Okay, anyone interested in adoption, go to campcocker.com. Thanks for your support, everyone. Hope you're having a nice weekend. Bye-bye.